Hi folks. This is our little back of the airplane talk here we're gonna have. I, I get this all the time. Uh, people who say, oh, I wish I had started this so much earlier, or this and that. Well, I started late. I started flying when I was 28. I already had a family, wife, couple of kids, job doing something else. And I, I've noticed this for, for a long time now. I may go somewhere socially, be in a group of people, a party or a get together or a function or something like that. And invariably you're talking to people and somebody will say, well, what do you do? I'm a pilot. And then what you hear so often is, oh, I always wanted to be a pilot. And I want to say, well, why didn't you? And everybody has, you know, life gets in the way. It slows you down. So what I want to tell you is, if you're really interested and you're watching these videos, use them for motivation and call your local airport or drive out there and talk to somebody about taking an introductory flying lesson. Just take the first step because success breeds success, one step up or another. You know, if you take an introductory flying lesson, chances are eventually you're gonna schedule a full flying lesson. Chances are you're gonna take a couple of lessons, which increases the probability that you'll solo. If you solo, you may not have your private pilot's license, you may never get it. But you can say you're a pilot because you flew that airplane. You were the pilot in command out there flying it around by yourself. And that's something to really be proud of. You shouldn't miss that opportunity if that's something that you really want. And the only way to move forward to it is just to take action. Take that one small step. You know, like I said, do a search on the internet for a flight instructor, a uh, flight training organization near your airport, or just drive out to the airport. Find an FBO. They can tell you where to go, who to talk to. Just do it because you don't want to be 20 years from now saying the same thing. And I'm not, I'm not saying this to discourage anybody or insult anybody, but I know what it's like because I was there and it's so easy to miss that opportunity. And then five years later be saying, Oh, I wish I had done that then, but at least I'm doing it now. So just get out there and do it guys and girls. Adios.